Hey there, hi there, ho there, I am Sharp James, this is James Reacts. Now, I am, I cannot overstate or understate, or I, I can't even simply state how excited I am for this trailer I'm about to watch. Teaser? Teaser trailer? I don't know. TV spot? Don't care. This is the official whatever for the new Scream movie coming out in January 2022. Don't know if we're going to call it Scream 2022, if we're just going to go ahead and call it Scream 5, because that's what it is. I have a bunch of thoughts that, I mean, most of them are probably wrong anyway. I'm so, like, it's 9 a.m. I'm supposed to be leaving for work in about 15 minutes ago. So, Entertainment Weekly had released a couple photos, like stills, whatever, from the movie that gave us a bunch of, you know, possibilities. For the past year and a half, two, three, 1700 years, we've had our own ideas as gooey, as gooey? Is Dewey gonna die in the opening? And that's what brings Sid and Gale together. Is Gale gonna be a killer? You know, was she in on it all along? Because she always does seem to solve everything magically on her own. Was she incognito with the killers the whole time? I feel like finally we might get a story that does not actually involve them. So it's not that someone again wants to kill Sydney, it's that someone is after Gale or Dewey or none of them. For some reason, I do think this is gonna skip the, a couple, the past couple sequels and kind of do what Halloween 2018 did, which is, you know, why they maybe changed the name to just Scream. Like, it's not gonna act as though the other ones didn't happen, but it's not going to acknowledge them as much and it's gonna be more of a connection to the first movie, maybe to the second movie. I don't know. I don't know. We don't know, and I'm gonna watch the trailer right now because I cannot, I cannot wait. What I'm expecting from this is nothing. It's like the best kind of nothing. And at the end, we're gonna see Ghostface, and he's gonna be like, I don't know, hi, Sydney, or whoever. Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm expecting lots of callbacks to the first movie. Shut up, shut up, Okay, here we go. Official, it says official trailer. I'm, I'm, okay, I'm very excited for this. Official trailer for Scream. Go. Who has those phones? Would you like to play a game, Tara? <laughs> doors unlocked. All doors locked. <laughs> doors unlocked. <laughs> this is too much, too, too fast. Three attacks so far. Do you have a gun? I'm Sydney Prescott. Of course I have a gun. <laughs> Something about this one just feels different. Oh my god, I'm already living so much for this. Samantha? That wasn't the opening I'm, kill I know before this. Oh. I've been through this a lot. This is your life now, which oh. means that whoever this that is is gonna keep coming for you. Someone. You ready? For this? Never. They're showing a lot of people being stabbed. There are certain rules to surviving. The attacks were all on people related to the original killers. I wish they hadn't given that away. Whatever is linked to our past, <laughs> it's pulled us all back here. And I won't sleep until he's in the ground. So they could have probably showed that a little less, but 
wow, I am going to watch that over and over and over and over again. The thing is, these trailers for Scream are usually very good with misdirection. They're good with misdirection and they don't show too much, and that's why I watched this one. So if I'm seeing lots of people get stabbed, I am not angry, and I don't think that something was given away to me. It would suck if the opening kill was shown to us, because that was very, like, an opening kill kind of moment in the beginning of this trailer, but I could be entirely wrong. Don't know what Judy was doing screaming in that car, but it, like, hit me. Do we, with like dropping the bullets, I am so sorry, I need to go to work, I need to, I can't be here anymore, it's not safe here. I'm very excited for this movie, I loved that trailer. Tell me your thoughts down below, like, comment, subscribe, uh, turn on notifications, and if you want to see way more content from me, I post way more often on Instagram. The tag is down below, and it's also, uh, there's a link in the description. Thank you for watching, James Reacts, goodbye. Shut up, James!